Hey there, Aaron Wills again, bringing you a reaction video again. Yep, going back to these, as long as it works. Every time I decide I'm not doing reaction videos anymore, I have to take it out of my open broadcast software that I use to make these videos. And then, once I decide I want to start doing these again, I gotta put it back in OBS, and that's not easy, for me anyway. I think it's supposed to be easy, but it's hard for me to figure out. Even though I've done it a few times, it just doesn't always work every time for me. So why am I going back to reaction videos? I'll tell you. I decided I wasn't going back to these. Ever. But... But I wasn't getting any views whatsoever on my, uh, my random rambling videos. At least I was getting some views on these videos. Uh, I don't know what I want to watch this time. We got, we got a video right here that says, Hold on, pig, getting you fired. Cops serve instant karma to stupid Karens. All right. We can go to Gordon Ramsay. We uh, might watch some, uh, I like uh, eating and I like watching Gordon Ramsay, so maybe we'll select Gordon Ramsay today. We haven't done Gordon Ramsay yet, I don't believe. Here it is, let's see. That's uh, Hell's Kitchen, I'd rather do, uh, let's do this, uh, Please, and cops serve instant karma to stupid Karens. Here we go. We're gonna do that. When cops serve. Oh, you've. When cops serve instant karma to stupid Karens. Let's watch this now. There we go. Full screen. I don't know who that guy is, but he's got nice eyes, doesn't he? He's got good hair and nice eyes. I'd fuck him. No. I'd have him suck my dick, though. If he really wanted to. I'm kidding again. All right, here we go. Never used samples like this before. This is Arcade, the ultimate sample plugin. You can play, edit, and manipulate any sound all within one plugin. Honestly, it's more like an instrument rather than a huge list of samples. Let me just show you. Instead of scrolling those... From having to teach a crazy lawyer who thought the world revolved around her some proper matters. I'm a lawyer. Please go ahead. Sit down. I can get a drink. I'm entitled to one. I have cancer, and you guys don't give a... To having to arrest a crazy Karen who totally lost her cool because she couldn't believe she was getting arrested for trespassing on school premises. I'm leaving with my daughter. Do not stop. Are you kidding me? If you fight, ma'am, it's I'm not fighting you, but you can let me. No. Let me my daughter. I'm not stop pulling my husband. Stop. Stop. You're hurting me. Stop. We'll stop fighting, ma'am. I'm not going to tell you again. Stop! Here are several examples of when cops serve instant karma to stupid Karens. Starting with the case of this angry Karen who thought she could trespass on school premises without consequences. We're going to stop right there. No. Because no, this is, I'm, I'm going to no. tell you right now how it works. You got to go. No, I'm not going nowhere because then you're going to be arrested for trespass. No, then you need to call the cops because that's not what happened. Oh, ma'am, I am a police officer. And I don't need you. That's a double negative tootsie roll. I'm not going nowhere. Double negative. Hope you're not a teacher. She keeps saying I'm leaving work. It's a school. Hope she's not a teacher. On the 21st of September 2023, police officers were called to Fitzgerald Middle School in respect of an angry woman who'd refused to leave the school premises after she was no longer welcome. When they had arrived at the scene, they met a crazy woman who refused all entreaties to nicely leave the premises. On her part, the woman, while busy complicating an otherwise simple situation, was ignorant of the fact that karma wasn't going to be as slow as... 
All right, so listen up. State Farm was trying to charge me $197 for car insurance. No, thank you. I got a friend who told me about this website. Now I'm spending 58 bucks a month. Full coverage. That's saving $139. It's amazing. All you do, you just go to this site, you put in some basic information, and you get all these options that show up. People start saving right away. All you got to do is just go check it out. It's that simple. The link's below. usual. Mel, I wasn't talking to her. Okay. And I wasn't doing that. So before you come in, you can listen to my part too, because that is a part of the program. Okay, we're going to stop right there. No. Because no, this is, I'm, I'm going to no. tell you right now how it works. She's the principal of this property. She gets to say who gets on this property. Okay. So she says, you got to go. Like that, but you got to go. No, I'm not going nowhere because. Then you're going to be arrested for trespassing. No, then you need to call the cops because that's not oh, what Ma'am, I am a police officer. And I don't need you. Okay. So you could don't. So, 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 I'm with my daughter. No, I'm leaving with my daughter. You do not. Stop. Are you kidding me? Yeah. So, that's what we're doing. If you fight, ma'am, it's I'm not fighting you, but you can let go of me. No. I would live under us. my daughter, and I'm no, no, absolutely not. We're not doing this. I'm calling my husband. Ma'am, this is crazy. I'm calling I'm my husband. I'm being husband. arrested because you guys let my daughter get sick off. Stop. I'm, not, I'm not, stop. stop calling my husband. Stop. Stop. You're hurting me. Stop. stop. We'll stop fighting. I want the cameras of Stop. Oh, my God. Stop. You're enjoying it. Ma'am, you're making it worse for yourself. Stop. 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 My wallet is in the way. I'm not dropping my wallet. Drop stop. it. It's going to be. I'm going to pick it up. Ma'am. I'm trying to hurt you. I'm trying my best to not hurt you. But if you keep fighting, this is going to be on you. You guys enjoy this? This is crazy. Ma'am. I'm not going to tell you again. Stop moving for you to do that. You're the one who had a panic attack. You can't control your back around my chest. Can you your stop back around my shirt? Yes, no, you can't. Stop. stop. Well, because I want to stop this to my daughter. I hope you guys have a good time at court. And paperwork should be documented too. That you guys are legal. Everything is work. on my camera, so don't you worry. Okay. Everything is all set. I know, and I told you guys that you had a teacher spit in my daughter's face. Ma'am. Okay, and you did not contact okay. me. Have a seat. You got my shirt wrapped up in here. I don't think I got my phone. Okay, you don't. Thank you. I would like my phone to call my husband, too. And I this? want the documents about my, my daughter being spit on by a person. This is about spitting on her daughter. Who spit on her daughter? Being spit on by a person. Well, yeah. Who else would spit on her? Well, maybe, I don't know, I guess. I don't know. Oh, yeah, spit on by a person. And then I wasn't notified about that. You guys are hiding documentation, so I'd like that. And I'm glad you guys dismissed her yesterday, but you should have notified me. That's all I wanted. But you guys can't, you came in here like Miss Hotshot. Trust us up the morning. And you have them twisted. Right after detaining her, to understand who they were dealing with, the officers had to interrogate the staff of the school. It was at this point that they began to understand the level of Karen they had just detained. What happened when she came in? So I walked in the side door and I heard her yell at the side door and I figured I'd put my stuff in, I'll come back. I told Miss Aaron I was going to take her to the back. I came out and I said, you know, nicely at first, hey, why don't you come to the back? She said, no, you're going to do, tell me who spit in my daughter's face. I said, we're not going to do it out here. I want you to come to the back. She said, no. And then she went on and on, you're going to blah, 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 person and so forth and say, you're not going to be able to do that here. She continued on. Yes, I am, because you're going to do X, Y, Z. And I said, ma'am, if you continue, I'm going to have to put you off the campus. I'm going to trespass you. I was clear. You're not going to do blank to me, blank, blank, blank. So I called you the first time. Then I decided, okay, let me see if she'll calm down, because I called her, let me see if she'll calm down. I heard your response, and then I said, why don't you calm down? But no, you call whoever you want to call. And... And then it just, right. she continued on until you walked in. And yeah, I, I thought she would calm down when you walked in and you could get her outside. And, and I, could, I could explain to her that we trespassed the sub. She's not welcome here anymore. She can't come back anymore. That I already handled it. I, I was trying to. Was something to do that. with that, that sub that was in the like, Yes. Oh, yes. Okay. Yes. So if she. See, I couldn't get any information. I couldn't get anything her. either because she kept going on. If she would have given me an opportunity, I would have told her, I suspended right. the lady, she can't come back to our school Even after anymore. she kind of semi 
I want to say semi calm down after she kind of quieted down sitting in her car I thought right. maybe that could right. calm it right. she still wouldn't get she kept saying that her daughter was spit on yes. so, so that was an incident where the substitute yes. teacher was yelling yes. and yes. she talked yes. and she yes. took it as like yes. a yes. 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 Okay. yes and I wanted to explain that to her I didn't want to trust that but I can't have her scaring all the rest of the parents up front her, yeah, no that was belligerent get, get. Sounds like the substitute teacher was yelling in her face and spitting all over her while she was doing so. He or she, I guess it was a she. Aren't all teachers females? No, I'm kidding. I know that they are not. I've gone to school enough from kindergarten or through, from kindergarten through 12th grade to know that they're not all, not all teachers are female. The majority of them happen to me, I would say. Not all of them. One well, my favorite teacher of all time, Dr. Hyder, was a male. He taught history and he taught intro to theater and theater at uh, St. Charles, not St. Charles, but St. Louis Community College, Forest Valley campus. Dr. Hyder, I don't know his first name, but he was my favorite teacher ever. He made class fun and he was funny and clever and charming. Uh, I don't know, he might have been charming. I don't really know if that didn't mean, but I could. All right, here we go. Looks like the sub teacher did spit in her face inadvertently while she was yelling at her in the face. Getting arrested so quickly didn't go down very well with her. Listen, if you're a woman, then you really should know some sort of self defense. And you are a woman. And right now, the U.S. Concealed Carry Association is hosting a 100% free. She's pretty. She's got nicer eyes than the guy did earlier. Uh, her hair is not as nice, but her eyes are just as pretty, if not more pretty, or prettier than that guy's eyes. Plus, she's a woman. Her her lips were puckered when I stopped this. Uh, when I stopped the video, I stopped it right when her lips were puckered. She wants to kiss me, I think. I think she wants to kiss me. Look at her staring at me. She wants to kiss me. Women's self defense workshop in your area. We're going to talk about how to keep you and your family safe, key situational awareness tips so you can avoid dangerous situations, how to choose the right self defense tool. Her efforts to make justifications for her actions were at best futile. So that's why it's not going on right now. Because you panicked and had a, like an anxiety there's no, attack. There was no panic. No, you didn't need to go that far. You're just I asked, asked, for no, I didn't. So you can I asked that lady right there. there. I said I wanted to have a conversation. I'm not sitting down. I'm sitting down. I leaned forward and said I wanted to have a conversation in the back. You guys, she got some stuff up her ass and then you came in here with your mouth. Okay. You guys didn't go ahead. We're going to go to my car. Let's go. And by the way, you're going to be in trouble for like not having somebody arrested. Sure, man. Absolutely. Whatever you say. Don't push me. Did you want? My shirt, my stomach. No, absolutely not. We're gonna go don't to push me. Ma'am, I don't push, push me. You're, you're pushing me. Stop. No, no I'm walking. Push you're push pushing me. Stop. I'm glad you're enjoying. Do you have anything here on you that's gonna poke me, stick me, hurt me? You need to read me my rights. I don't need to read your rights. I'm not asking you any questions about any criminal. Well, you can't arrest somebody without reading their rights. That's not how it works. <laughs> but sure, I think you want to read too much TV. Do you have any other things? Any pockets? Anything on you? Five seven six. Five seven six. Go ahead. Ma'am, I need you to write in your stamp, please. Yeah, I'm still bringing a time. Uh, ninety four. You should ask for backup too. Oh, ma'am, stop. I'm gonna hurt everybody so bad. Okay, I'll make sure nobody in my report. So. I would like you to call my husband too while you're at it, because they're the only ones that pick up my children. I am. When the reality began to dawn on her that she couldn't just go around trespassing on people's properties just because she wanted to, she decided to calm down, at least for the moment. So listen, now that, now that you've calmed down, okay, I, I need to ask you a few questions if that's okay, right? Because you have to understand why I now took the action that I took, right? Okay, so, uh, no, I don't agree with you. Okay, so, so here, here. Now she has to read her Miranda, right? So she's going to ask her some questions. 
You don't have to read, read the rights unless you're going to ask questions. Here she goes. Here's the thing, right? When you're so belligerent, I want them to listen to me. Okay, okay, stop. Okay, that's listen. Are you going to let me finish or do I have to roll the window again? But you guys aren't listening. You're, you're, in, you're talking over me and you're interrupting me. You're doing the as same as thing. You did that, when you were inside. This is what landed you under arrest to be inside. You did that to me inside. Okay. You did the same thing okay. up to You know what? Since this is not going to happen, then we have nothing left to say. Come in with me. Yeah, I know. I heard you. Let's go. You just, I just want to take my pants off. I don't know if that's the issue. One will be a point of two, you can go charge. Do you want to take your pants off? I do. Okay. It takes two seconds. I just don't want my lady lump lump stuff and falling out of me. Wait, wait, wait. I'm asking what you, uh, what you want. This is twisted, too. That's why it kind of hurts. Thank you. Just, it's actually the front. Because my, my, would you like me to do it? Yeah, my baby lump. Okay, there you go. That's fine. You have. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna my shirt. Yeah, that's fine. You're okay. So all your items, including your ID, I'm gonna take your. Where's your car parked? My car is right over there. In the parking. Okay. This um, and I actually I don't know if you could do this too, but I was supposed to leave this school and go over there because there was a bomb threat over there for my son, and he's not in school right now. He's home alone. Okay. All right. We'll, we'll help you out with all that. She was eventually charged with trespass after warning and resisting arrest. The fact remains that although this woman was ignorant, she was nothing like Shamaya Hill, who thought it was a smart idea to kick and bite officers when she was arrested for failing to appear in court. Do not kick, do not kick, don't start doing that, because that's going to get you in a lot more trouble. Doing for what? You keep kicking my sergeant? That's enough. Don't try to bite me again. Do not try to bite me again. On the 22nd of February 2023, police officers on patrol duty observed a young woman who was approaching vehicles and appeared to need help. When the officers approached her, she tried to make them realize that she was involved in an altercation with her boyfriend. Coming up on the PokerStars Big Game on Tour, it's Dave versus Sam, the rematch. So we meet again? <laughs> we do the deed, sir. Ah. <laughs> you see my cards? You must pay the tax. While loose cannon Lily ups the aggression. Lily! All I've ever wanted to do is put you in the blender. Yeah, you are, I'm, in, I'm in there. But will it pay off? Oh my god. Wow. You ain't seen nothing yet! Resorts World Las Vegas plays host to the North American Poker boyfriend who had driven away, leaving her stranded. At the time when the officers began the interrogation, they had no idea that a simple intervention would lead to an arrest of one of the most ignorant Karens ever. What, what do you want to report? Are you stolen? Yeah. Okay. Where was it stolen? It got stolen, like, up the street. I was, I don't know the exact address, but it was very close to my mom. No. It wasn't at a business, it was like almost, pretty much the main street. Yeah, the okay. main street. Who took it? Who stole it? My ex. What's his name? I'd rather not be told. Okay, okay well, I'm not, I'm, if you're telling me that you know who stole it, I'm not going to take the report from you if you're not going to cooperate with me and tell me who stole it. He has your whole purse? Yeah. So he took your, not just your, your ID, he took your entire purse? Yeah. Okay, what did your yeah. purse look like? Where did you meet this guy at? Um, we can bet. They just took me up off the street for the night, so... How long have you, how long have you known him? You just meet it's him today? It's been over like two years. Been no, I didn't, I didn't meet him today. You got into an argument? Uh -huh. a little, and, and he, did he take the purse from you? Was he in a car or were you guys what? In the car. He was in the car? Yeah. Okay, so your purse was in the car? Yeah. And he took off Sorry. in the car with your purse? Yeah, there's, there's I saw you. I recently saw something wrong with his car. I used to work on cars. Okay. For a short period of time. Okay. And I was, you know, like, we have a beautiful car. I was hopefully he would have sold it. He would have sold it to me. But it was something going on, like, with the front wheel. Uh 
For the time being, she saw no need to show the cops the stuff she was made of. Perhaps it was a ploy to avoid getting in trouble. However, as much as she tried to avoid it, things started taking a turn for the worse when the officer ran her name through the system and discovered that there was a warrant issued for her arrest. But you don't know where, this, where you were staying? But it was somewhere here, here in Orange? I don't know how to, I just know how to Was it an apartment? Was it a condo? Was it a house? It's a house. It's a house? Yeah. So you don't, live, you, you don't live in the city, you haven't lived in the city in a long, that address in the city, you haven't lived there for a long time? No. I'm familiar with it. What's that? I'm familiar with the city. Yeah, but that address you gave me, that 7700 Timber, when was the last time you were there? It's, it's been, um, it's been over 10 months now. Well, well, so you only been living here, here for two months, where did you live in between there? I'm just trying to figure out where, like, where you've been living, because I'm trying to find some place that I could take you for tonight, if, if, instead of having you outside all night. We've been asking I you if there was a place to... we could take you to stay, and now you're telling me you're going to wait for the bus. I so I'm just... yeah. Unfortunately, you have a warrant out for your arrest, so you're under arrest right now, okay? You have a warrant on Evergreen Park. So did some, I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name before. So did some, I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name before. I know, I know it's, it's I know it's Hill. Last name, right? No. Was it Hill? Okay. So, did did anything happen in Evergreen Park or Oak Park? I believe they said not Oak Lawn, Oak Park. No. Do you know what I'm talking about? I don't know if it was something where they were looking to try to find you, or you got arrested and didn't go to court or something. Do Do you have any idea what what that might be from? Any idea? I'm not really sure. No. Anything that you could think of from Oak Park? But no. No. Mm -hmm. Well, we'll get some, we're reaching out to them now. We'll get some more information on what it's about or when it was or maybe something would ring a bell when we get more info and then we'll let you know. Um, but right now, so basically what we're going to be doing, we're going to take you back to the station, we're going to reach out to them and then figure out what those departments want to do. Because it's nothing Orland Park related, but it is something that we have to bring it back and then we'll go from there. Despite her efforts to stay calm, it was getting difficult for her to believe that she was going to jail. In addition to her already having one of the worst evenings ever. Although she was already beginning to act difficult, the cops had no idea that this was just the beginning. I have to take out, take off the bags. It's probably not a good idea. What are you doing again? You're, you're being, you're being placed under arrest because you have a warrant. I'm just asking if you had more stuff. I can, we'll, we'll get that stuff for you. But I'm, I was just asking if you had any more things that we needed to gather for you. That's all. You don't have to answer. Everybody watched. Everybody loves Raymond. Today, there's less and less of those shows that bring us all together. Right. We absolutely shared that. It was just like a wonderful thing that brought us together. Most had nothing to do with politics. Your path, it is so different from what I noticed in Hollywood. You're a lifelong Catholic. How did you... How much work did Patricia, Patricia Heaton have done? My gosh, look at her. Your faith impact your career. I went to the showrunner and I said, I just need to tell you I'm pro-life. One person said, that was the bravest thing I've ever seen anybody do. Of all the issues that you feel like Christians should be thinking about, the issue should... Answer that. I'm just asking you. In case you're wondering, I personally am pro-choice all the way. Pro-choice all the way. My buddy Brandon disagrees with that. I have to check to make sure there's no weapons right now. So turn around. I'm taking your bag off. I'm just going to put it down right here. Okay. Well, I need my bag. Your bag's going to go with going you. With you but, no. but in the back of the car, you can't have your bag in the back of the car, okay? Yeah, but I don't know you guys, so this is kind of weird. It's a so lot weird. We're, we're with the Orland Park Police Department, like you said before. Um, right now, you're going to be under arrest. We have to take the bag off of you, but the bag is going to come with you in the car with us, okay? It's going to be, I'm just going to lift it up over your head, okay? Get any leg room, just like make it a quick. No, I'm okay. okay. Like, this, yeah. No, I'm okay. This is, yeah, this is so weird. We, we have to take your bag off, okay? Like you don't no, I'm your okay. Bag. We're going to take it with us. I'm okay with okay? the bag. Take it where? To the station with us. It's coming with you and. Why, why are you about the station? I, I told you about, you had uh, the warrants, like we explained to you a couple times. You have two warrants. One was Evergreen Park, one was Oak Park. 
Hey, Chad, you want to come open the door? No, that's kind of weird. I'm okay. So, so here's kinda what's going to happen. That's weird. You're, you're in custody right now, and we have to take you to the station. Based on okay? what? You have a warrant. You have a warrant. Yeah. Have warrant. No, that's definitely weird. Who's thing up the park, you know, and I'll meet yeah. you at the station. What are you doing? Okay, hey, hey, hey. Okay. No, that's weird. That's weird. Okay. This is a bed. Walk around. Walk around where? We're going right next to that open door. We told you a bunch of times. You have a warrant for your arrest. No, I'm okay. This is weird. No, I'm okay. She keeps saying this is weird. What's weird? You have a warrant. You have two warrants. Why is it weird? It might suck, but it's not weird. You're weird. You're saying it's weird. Something in her bag that she doesn't want them to see, that's for sure. In the car. This is weird. Why are you putting me in this car? Because you're under arrest. Under arrest. However, the However, fact, the fact that, that she was not being much, much of a Karen, Karen at the moment didn't, didn't mean that she was going, going to be an easy walkover. walkover. You're under arrest. Just relax. I'm taking you to the police station. Do you understand that? No. Stop kicking. It's weird. And relax. <laughs> no, I got it. No, this is weird. Stop. You can get your hands off me. I'm taking you to the police station and you keep trying to get out of this car. So I'm not taking my hands off of you because you're going to... Yeah, you're trying to push me and kick out of the car. Okay, so let me go then. Doesn't work that way. Let me go. I don't want to be here. This is stupid. Let me go. So you have a couple warrants out. I don't want to be here. Well, too bad, Tootsie Roll. That's how it works. No one wants to be there when they're getting arrested. No one wants to get arrested. Maybe some weirdos that think it's weird to get arrested. They might want to be arrested. Uh, no one else wants to get, no one else wants to be there when they're getting arrested, so, so. No, I don't have any warrants, so let me go. Oh, now she knows if she has a warrant. She more than he does. I'm supposed to let you go, okay? You gotta keep your legs in, and we gotta close your door. Why? We can't discuss this standing there. Okay, so what about, what about all of that stuff in the middle of the street? I'm gonna go get it. Why don't you guys take care of that? You could be worried about that. Okay? Thanks, Maya. Come on out. I'm not coming out. Well, you have to come out. I'm not coming out. You have to come out. Why? This is weird. I have to come out of this car. I'm living in this car. This is weird. You have to go into the doorway. Why? This is weird. If you don't want to come out of the car, they'll drag your fat ass out of the car, trust me. It's never happened to me, but I know how this works. I'm not getting out of the car. I'm not getting out of the car. I'm not getting out of the car. Well, I bet you're getting out. I bet you're getting out of the car. Because we have to go in the building. I'm not going in there. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Why don't you want to get out of the car? Before you didn't want to get in the car, now you don't want to get out of the car. We're going to go inside and we're going to sit down. Okay? We're going to figure out why you have a warrant for your arrest, okay? If you don't want to get out voluntarily, then I'm going to be forced to pull you out of the car. Yeah. Why don't you just get out of the car? Well, like I said, we're going to go right inside the building here. Jemaya, I'm trying to be real. It's not nice like I'm here, okay? But you're not making it easy. Do you understand? Do you know what a warrant for an arrest is? Okay. I don't know what that is. Okay, so according to Evergreen Park, you were arrested by them before for criminal damage to property. You didn't show up for court, so there's a warrant out for your arrest because you didn't go to court, okay? So when I ran your, when you gave me your name and I ran your name, it says Evergreen Park has a warrant for this person's arrest. Is Shemaya, is Shemaya Hill your real name or did you give me a fake name? That's the name that you gave me. The name and date of birth that you gave me was Shemaya. Okay, well. Okay, well then we need to fingerprint you to find out. If you're not Shemaya Hill, your fingerprints will tell us that. <laughs> is that what building? Right here. Mean... The building, the door's right here. Rather than being smart enough to make things easy for everyone involved by cooperating with the cops, she kept pushing her boundaries. However, she'd soon come to realize that these cops meant business. I just need you to get out of the car so we can take your fingerprints. No. Well, 
I told you, you're going to get out of the car one way or the other. This is yours, right? Because this is going in the building. If you want this, you're going to have to go in the building. I said I don't feel safe here. No, I know. When we were outside. That means I don't feel safe. When we were outside I don't before, be here. you had mentioned uh, you're I don't here. There's nowhere, you have there's nowhere we can go. Okay? I, know, I don't want to be here. So if you wanted to talk to a lawyer, you can make a phone call. Phone no, I shouldn't have to talk to a lawyer because it's not that it's not that serious, but I just feel scared. That's why I said it was. Stand up, walk out on your own accord. I don't even know you. Okay. We don't know you either, okay? Like so we're at the point now where I'm not at any point. I'm okay with this. Like this this is not you have to come out and walk inside. Well, how, how else? How can I don't even you know what the word warrant means. So, no, I don't, I don't understand. I don't understand. Warrant means a judge said that you did something wrong and the judge wants you arrested and brought to court. That's what a warrant means. Okay? So, this judge issued the warrant saying that you need to be taken into police custody and brought. Hi there and welcome to this video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to optimize and customize your. Hi, Jake. In the commercials on this video, there's been some hot chicks in the commercials. To court, okay? This can go on all night. This isn't gonna, this isn't ever gonna end. So to make it end, you have to go in and give us your fingerprints. You're getting out of this car. I, I, we've had enough of, of this, okay? I'm not getting out of the car. Yes. No, I'm not walking. We're I don't want to right inside. What okay. Talking about. We're gonna explain it to you. I've explained it to you a bunch of times already. I get. I will get it. We'll get it. What's that? Must be rag. We're going to spend like uh, money. No one's taking your money, but you can't have anything. You can't have anything on you or with you. Because, okay? because you are refusing to cooperate. That is why. Do not, do not kick. Do not right. kick. Don't start doing that. Doing that's going to get you in a lot more trouble. Doing for what? Kicking. I didn't kick you. You, yeah. you put your leg back and I was standing okay, right Okay, so why did you touch me? You put why did you me, touch me, okay? We're touching you because you're refusing to cooperate. Get off of me. I didn't do wrong. You have to take everything away from you and not even touch. All right. Now we're done. Now. Now we're done with that. For some reason, she believed that complicating an otherwise simple situation was going to get her out of it. A thought that was at best delusional. Because you just kicked me again. I didn't kick you. Yes, you did. Why do you keep saying I'm kicking you? Because you kicked me. It's not going to help me. It is going to help something. See, get out of my pocket. Why are you doing this shit? Sit up. I've had enough. You're kicking my sergeant? That's enough. All right. All right. All right. Just let her. Quick kick Sit. Put your legs out. Mm -hmm. Get off of me. Get off of me. Get off of me. Get off of me. Get Yeah, you know, this, this side. Like a pen or something. Let's just cooperate, right? I'm just making everything harder. Huh? All you're doing is adding more charges onto yourself for By doing what? Kicking and doing all this stuff. I don't know okay? what charges are. It's all that's weird. happening. Why are you putting shackles on me? Because you keep kicking. I didn't kick anybody. Look at your legs. <clears throat> you're going to sit down like. I didn't kick anybody. This is weird. Well, I don't know what kick means. I don't know what kick means. This is weird. What does kick mean? This is weird. Well, this is definitely more with this stuff. It's only going to be a kicking. Stand up. As soon as I can do that, we can work on getting you out of here. We can't do any of that until we start with this process. We have to search you. I didn't do anything, though. You're trying to incriminate me for what? I don't want to take this coat off, but I don't want to do that again. You told me many times why you were too tough to do No. It's, it's not a matter of whether you want to or not. I don't understand. What do you not understand? 
why I'm here. You have a warrant for your arrest. I shouldn't have a warrant. You do. Because I didn't you take up you a do. Okay, well. You have two of them. From two different I towns. Have a warrant. You have two. You don't have one. You have two. Okay. From two different towns. I don't know what you're talking about. Eventually, it started becoming obvious that she was taking the officer's niceness for granted and was determined to make things as frustrating as possible for everyone. Unfortunately for her, justice was meant to take its full course. That's, that's it. I can't see anything anymore. The guy's still talking, but I don't see the video, so I'm gonna hang it up.